today I have an Acer laptop. It's an Acer model number E15. And I'm going to be showing you how to boot, to change the boot device to uh, USB. All right, so you turn on the computer and you just start pressing F2. Okay, until you see. Um, okay, maybe I did that a little too late. Let's try it again. I'm gonna shut off the computer. Okay, turn it back on. Just start repeatedly pressing F2. Trying to get to the this screen. This is where you, you want to be in this screen. Okay. All right, you have system information, main security and boot. Okay, when you get to this screen, you want to navigate to boot. So use your, these keys right here and just uh, select the key that is going to select the key that is going to take you to the boot order so in this boot order this shows how this shows you how the computer boots so the computer is first the system is going to look for uh the boot order right now it's the usb fit the disk drive that's the fdd uh the cd rom drive and then the usb cd rom windows boot manager and then the western digital hard drive and then network and then usb hard drive so this operating system on this computer crashed and i'd like to install windows 10 on it and so i've i've downloaded the windows 10 already and it's on this uh, flash drive right here and um now uh how do i change the boot order so that the computer can boot from my usb stick that has the windows 10 operating system okay so um use your arrow keys right and just start tapping it until you get to the usb disk drive or your pen drive so it's at number seven right now to get it up there on an acer computer might be the same on other computers but um, i'm using an acer just press f5 f5 will uh, move the USB drive to number eight. F6 should get us up to number one. So you want it to be the first item, the first device that is seen by the computer when it's when it is booting. So just press F6 repeatedly until you get to the that USB drive to number one. So right now it's at number one. Okay. Um, you can also move move your hard drive to be the second boot option. So let's fix that right now. I don't know why it said six. So let's move the hard drive. It's the one that says HDD Western Digital. Uh, the WDC is Western Digital. Okay, so let's move it to numbers to be the second item over here. Okay. Now, don't forget to press F10 so that you can save these changes. So f10 f10 save changes so to save the changes just press enter okay your computer is going to restart and then when it restarts it should be starting from the usb stick or from your your flash drive all right so let's just wait for the computer to restart Yeah, sorry about the picture on this. It's just uh, there's a lot of light coming from outside. That's why it's a little bit white. There's nothing wrong with the screen. It's just the uh, amount of light coming from outside. All right, so let's give it a few seconds here. It should be booting from the USB drive in, in a few seconds. Okay. Okay, let's see. gonna boot from the usb drive if we did it properly yes all right so this blue screen means we are winning so it's you see so now it's booting we're now booting from the usb drive okay and when you get to this point up here until you get to okay so i want to select next i just use the tab i'll just use the tab then press enter and then 
I'm still not. But all right. So that's all you need to do. And to keep this video short, I'm not going to go through the whole setup process, but the video is about how to select how to choose the USB drive is the the one to boot from and um, I hope this has been beneficial to you if it has been beneficial at all please consider subscribing to the channel see you on the next one ta-ta